all the way from Haley, Idaho, the head football coach of the Wood River Wolverines and the former Pirate great Shane Carden joins us now. Shane, how are you making it out there? You know, we're doing okay. Uh, we got some games scheduled that hopefully we get to play, um, but that's in the school board hands as I'm learning as a head football coach in high school. You know, that's, that's uh, higher up decisions, not mine. All right, take us back to your East Carolina career and your very first start came at Southern Mississippi at Hattiesburg. Yeah, um, that that day I actually missed the 8 a.m. class, um, and then that next week, Coach Riley had asked me why I missed, and I said I just I was so nervous about the game. I wanted to make sure I got enough sleep so I felt good. <laughs> I laughed at me and said, "Okay, you're in trouble," but good answer. So uh, we were able to go down there and get a win, and um, a couple of funny memories from that start. You know, my first touchdown, I accidentally didn't I didn't know what to do. I just ran to the sideline. I didn't know how to celebrate. And, Andrew Bodenheimer and just, you know, he was right behind me, apparently following me the whole way. And so then at practice, I got plenty of flack for that, for not celebrating. So none of the guys would give me high fives that first day of practice and got back. Um, but no, I mean, it's a great win. And, um, you know, for in the comparisons to Brett Favre, with him playing there, I mean. <laughs> the last time East Carolina won a bowl game, the date was December 23rd, 2013, the Beef O'Grady's Bowl. And Shane Carden had a touchdown reception in the game, didn't he? Yeah, uh, I sure did. And, um, you know, we're doing the walkthrough before the game in a very nice room in the hotel with a nice big chandelier. And uh, the last play we're going to call in that kind of walkthrough was the throwback. And so throw it to Cam Worthy. Cam Worthy throws it back. And, and he must have barely missed that chandelier, maybe by a few inches. <laughs> um, and I caught it, and the whole room was silent. And we all just kind of looked at each other and then just kind of took a big deep breath that we didn't have to pay, pay for that, you know, huge chandelier. And, um, you know, the rough kind of laughs like, well, it wasn't coming out of my uh, salary because that I couldn't afford that thing. What's your best memory as an East Carolina Pirate? And it's got to have something to do with the great use of that tattoo. <laughs> it's there's there's so many moments that, you know, just I look back on and, and get to share and talk about, you know, it's hard. It's hard to really put in one, um, you know. I think my favorite game was going to North Carolina my junior year winning, um, you know, not not having our school win there in, in such a in such a long time. And, you know, I remember, you know, I, I like just got on Twitter that year and I remember getting on there and I didn't have many followers and all of a sudden the thing just started dinging on the bus ride home and wouldn't stop and the picture started blowing up and yeah, it blew up. And I know, um, you know, there's a couple, a couple more tattoos going around. I love the pictures I get of the kids because they start doing the, uh, the stick on tattoo and it's awesome. I mean, it's, it's, it's school pride. It's what EC is about, man. You flex your muscles, be tough and, and, and show your, show your prior pride. The 2017 arena football league rookie of the year was Shane Card. What was that year like? You know, it was interesting. Um, you know, I, I definitely got a great appreciation for that league. I, I underestimated it when I first got there and there's a lot of talented players in that league. There were, I guess now that they've shut it down, but unfortunately I had a couple back concussions that, that kind of ended that for me and just decided I, I was ready to, to move on and, and be in football in another uh, realm. Looking forward to looking for the scores this fall for the Wood River Wolverines every Friday night. The head football coach there is Shane Carden. Shane, thanks so much. Brian, thank you.